YouTube, it's your girl Melissa coming back at you with another product review. In today's video, I am really, really excited to bring you another video about Asus hair. That's right guys, if you didn't join me for my first video on Asus hair, it is a company who sells both synthetic and real hair wigs. And in my last video, I actually did a review on this lovely beauty. For anybody who hasn't seen the video, I'll definitely link it somewhere about here so that you're able to take a, a look at that first video. Today I'm actually going to be doing a wig haul. So that's why my hair is kind of slicked back. I'm excited because I ordered three more wigs. So I know if you watched the last video, I was super excited because of the quality and how well this one turned out that I just had to order more. So I ordered some totally different looks and I'm really, really excited to bring you guys along on the journey so that I can try these on. I have not yet taken them out of the package. So these are the wigs. From what I can tell, Either there's a larger or longer wig in this box and then I'm guessing by the weight difference it's probably two in here and one in here but I actually don't know because I haven't opened them yet if this is your first time landing on my channel and this is the kind of video that you like I encourage you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and while you're at it make sure that you hit that notification bell too so that you can get alerts to the latest and greatest from me but let's get right into the review I'm really really excited to get this unboxed Okay, I'm gonna start with the smaller box and see what we've got here. So, if you watched the last video, Asus Hair will always send you a cute little wig brush and a wig cap with every wig that they send. And it's been a while since I ordered this, so I actually sort of forgot what I ordered. <laughs> So it's kind of like Christmas. I have no idea what I'm going to unpack. The wigs are really lovely and uh, packaged really, really well. They have been sitting in this box a while, so I'm hoping they're not too crumpled up, but you've got the little net and then you've got the wig. Oh, that's cute. So almost like the previous one, but in a really pretty, pretty brown to blonde ombre with a soft wave. I remember this one now. So this is the wig and I just fluffed with my hands. So it's got a really cute fringe bang and a beautiful natural brown to like an ashy blonde ombre. I'm gonna go ahead and install the wig cap and also install the wig and I'll allow you guys to see that process and then I will come back and let you know what I think and I'll get your opinion as well. I'll be right back. wig number one and again these are synthetic wigs so you are to expect that you shouldn't be doing any kind of heat styling hence the reason why they come with already having a light style which I absolutely love now my objective for getting this particular wig was because I actually used to have my hair almost identical to this color and style and I very very often miss my bangs and I think anybody that's had bangs that like them probably is in the same boat where you just have this urge to cut your hair and even color it and I think right now I'm just really focused on healthy hair and I don't want to do all of that bleaching or cut it if I have the urge to do that so I think that wigs are really fun a really really affordable way to get the look that you want without having to spend big money at the hairstylist to have a major cut and color and then damage your hair so this is wig number one. I think that it looks really, really good. I think if I had to play around with it a little, cause there are a few little straggler hairs in the front kind of near the bang and they're sort of poking me right now, but I think that's pretty normal with any wig. Like you're gonna have to maybe cut a little bit and sort of adjust the wig to your face. But considering that I didn't do anything to it, I really think that it worked really, really well. 
So I would love to hear in the comments what you guys think about this look. So obviously it's a cute lob style with a really pretty natural wave, a dark brown to ashy blonde balayage, and I think it looks really cute. I'm excited to try this and kind of wear it out and see if people think that I cut my hair. But I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the next wig because we still have two more to get through and I'd love to get your guys' opinions. So definitely let me know in the comments below what you think of wig number one and then we're gonna go through and do the same thing for two and three. And at the end, I'm really, really excited to see which wig is your favorite. For anybody that did watch my original video, Video for Aces hair, I would love to find out if you liked that wig better than any of the ones I'm showing you guys today. So without further ado, let's open the second box. Okie dokie, next wig. So even though I ordered this all at one time, I did get another cap and brush, which is nice. I've got two wigs in this box as I expected. So I'm not sure what's what, so I'm just gonna go ahead and open up the first one. I'm just really amazed at how nice the quality is on these wigs for the price. I mean, you cannot go wrong. I got these buy two, get one free, and I think the most expensive wig that I got was like $24. So it's crazy to me that you can get three wigs for 50 bucks and have them look this nice. So if there's anybody out there that's looking for a high quality wig, I am not in any kind of paid partnership with Asus. I just really am so happy that I stumbled upon this company because, oh my gosh, like, do you see how pretty that is? So you can see I kind of, <laughs> I went on a bang kick. I don't really have a lot of experience with wigs full transparency and for me I'm afraid of lace fronts because you know you have to do like the style and you kind of gotta like put your edges down and you gotta like snip it a little and kind of do all that and I'm just not there yet so I really like to depend on that bang to give me that coverage and kind of more of that natural look and I also really missed my bang so I know I mentioned that a few times already but I want to reiterate that's why the styles that I selected were the ones with the bangs obviously they've got lots and lots of other styles that don't have bangs I mean pages upon pages of really beautiful wigs. I will definitely also, if anybody likes the wigs that I'm trying on, I will make sure to link each wig and its skew in the description below so that you know exactly which one to order in case you guys want one because I'm not at all in affiliation with them and I don't get credit for it, but there are so many wigs and some of them look really, really similar and I wanna make sure that if you do want the wig that you see in today's video that you get the right one. Without further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and get this one on and I will show you the finished product in just a moment. Okay, so this wig is substantially longer as you can see. So I'll back up a little so that you can see how it looks. So it still has a really soft balayage, but it is far less noticeable than the tone that you see in the shorter wig. The bang on this one is quite a bit longer. It's kind of like poking me in the eye right now. So I would personally probably trim it so that it wasn't quite as long. I know some people do kind of like the curtain bang look and I just, I'm not a big fan of that. So right now it is a little long and I will probably trim it down. But overall, I think that it is really a beautiful wig. The hair is nice and thick. It feels full, it's bouncy. I love the I love the style. Overall, I'm really, really happy with it. It's way too hot right now <laughs> to wear this wig. This is definitely gonna be something I wear a little bit closer to like fall and winter because it is so much hair and because it's synthetic. Just first of all, when it gets really hot, I have to wear my hair in a ponytail anyway. So having
having like a wig cap and a big, heavy, you know, voluptuous wig, I would definitely be like having a hardcore heat stroke. In general though, I think it's a really, really pretty wig. The color is gorgeous. It really does feel like human hair. And I have a lot of extensions, like Remy hair extensions, and it's really not that far off. I wouldn't know that this was synthetic. If I saw it on the street, I wouldn't even second guess if this was a wig. So very, very happy with wig number two. But again, let me know guys in the comments below what you guys think. Wig number two, we've got a longer style with a more subtle balayage and a little bit longer bang. It could probably be a curtain bang. And we've got wig number three on the way. So I will go ahead and get that installed so that you can vote on which wig that you think is the best. And again, don't worry guys, I will be sure to link all of the products in the description below in case there's anything that you decide that you want from this wig haul. Catch you guys in just a second. Okay, so this is the third and final wig. So obviously guys, I have a thing for bangs and balayage. I have a BB problem. <laughs> um, but really, in all seriousness, I really, really desperately wanted to have a bang and I really missed the beautiful balayage that I used to have in my hair, but it's just so damaging. So in order to get that look at a much much more affordable cost with no commitment and no damage to my hair. I chose Asus wigs because I really, really fell in love with the very first wig that I tried from them. And I knew that if I tried additional wigs that I wouldn't be disappointed. And I don't know about you guys, but I absolutely love the styles that they offer. And the prices are like unbeatable. You can't even get that at a wig shop. I mean, you could go to a little corner wig shop and pay 50 or $60 easy for something like this. Of this type of quality and like the color, I really can't say enough about it. I'm so, so excited. Don't forget to go in the comments and vote. So we've got wig number one. We've got a beautiful fringe bang, a long bob with a beautiful balayage. So that's number one. Number two was the long brown soft balayage with the fringe bang. This is the one that had the longer bang or the one that I'm wearing now, which is also a balayage, but you can see that it almost goes to gray on the ends. I have always wanted to do that to my hair and every stylist has always talked me out of it because of how damaging it is. So it is so satisfying to be able to achieve that look without the damage to my hair. This has been so much fun and I wanna thank everybody in advance for voting below. I can't wait to see your responses. If you are new to my channel and this is the kind of video that you like, I encourage you to hit that subscribe button and make sure to hit that notification bell as well so that you can get alerts to the latest and greatest from me. I've got lots of really awesome content planned in future videos and I would love to see you back to my channel. For anybody who has already subscribed and is a loyal supporter, I wanna thank you again for taking the time out to watch my videos, for hitting that like button, for commenting below. Every single thing that you do to interact with my channel definitely helps me to grow my channel and I deeply, deeply appreciate it. I had such an amazing time filming this video. If you enjoyed it, please consider giving it a thumbs up, but it has been so awesome hanging out with you. Don't quit your daydream, and until next time.